So today we're out in sunny Brentwood, Essex to interview the female IBF bantamweight champion, Ebony Bridges. Let's see what the Blonde Bomber's got to say. Moving on to a different topic, slightly controversial as well, obviously trans um, rights in yep. sports is a, big, is a big topic at the moment. Um, people, you know, switching gender and then coming up against yep. the opposite gender. How do you feel about that and would you ever entertain the thought of fighting someone who's no, who's changed Never. no you wouldn't Ever. do that no i think it's wrong in in especially in boxing i think mm. in all sport um from i just feel like you know you see all these like recently like a lot of the women in sport that are breaking records <laughs> weren't originally women right. do you know what i mean and then it's the sport like where you're trying to hurt each other mm. the goal is actually to hurt that person yeah you know and it's you're a born man i don't care what you say how many hormones you're taking you're still a born man that's like saying like Oh, all of a sudden Mike Tyson's like, okay, oh, I want to be a girl now. Mm. Like, and then goes and fights you. No way. Like, it's, yeah. And what, how do you measure it? Well, oh, they don't look really masculine, so that's that's okay. No, because I even spy like boys, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Um, or like guys that are smaller than me and they're hell strong. Right. Do you know what I mean? So it's, no, I, I think it's, a, especially in combat sports, but in general in sports, I think women are losing. Uh, well, like, think about like a female growing up wanting to be the best in her sport mm -hmm. and then like it's you know well now she actually has to compete against um men who's transitioned obviously into women and that just takes the whole femi fem feminine side yeah. and then you got me women who turn into men or transition into men that go in against the men which never happens mm. very rarely it's always the other way around there's no girls go oh, i'm gonna be a go, go you know it's very interesting because I feel, feel like I want to be a, a male yeah. and then they go into women, men's sport they don't do that no. it's the only ever the other way around that's, that's true yeah. and if it was the other way around for example in combat sports and a born female went into a male combat mm. like unless she's taken a lot of testosterone and steroids which is banned like yeah. you're going to get blasted by men yeah, like yeah. you know like I mean surely you might be able to beat some men but it's still very it's, dangerous like, yeah I, it's I, just, I, it's, 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 yeah, maybe they need their own separate kind of... Yeah, definitely. Have class. your own separate... Have, yeah. have, have born females, men, and then born... Ma I, I don't know. I, I'm not really... Sorry, I'm not really educated in it as in what, is, what, what the terminology, they call themselves. Yeah, terminology, same. but, right. you know, trans men and then trans women, mm -hmm. you know, and then they can all just um, fight each other in their own divisions. I think that's fair, you know. Um, and it's um, I know it's unfortunate because they are a minority and that's obviously something they feel that they want to do. Yeah. But they the reality is, is biologically, they're yeah. still what they are. The danger is, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not worth the and risk, it just is takes it? away from the, from the women, from yeah. the women's sport. The achievements. Women's sport, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Like, okay, if you can do that, let, let women take steroids. <laughs> like, I don't know. No, no. Well, there's people that say that, you know, like, there should be a totally separate oh, class for, yeah. for athletes that want to take performance-enhancing yeah. drugs and, exactly. and clean athletes. Exactly, well, I have that in bodybuilding, you know what I mean? Oh, okay, like, yeah, yeah. I did bodybuilding, I did natural bodybuilding, so we used yeah. to get drug tested when we competed, but you got non-drug you got non -drug tested bodybuilding, which is obviously, okay, well, if you're not getting tested, you're gonna take steroids, aren't you? Yeah. But the natural is means that you're gonna get tested, yeah. so you don't take steroids. Right, right, yeah. nice, But they have that in bodybuilding. Yeah. It's That's... very different. You can, <laughs> you got Mr. Olympia, and then you got the naturals, which is like, like, to yeah, yeah, so, yeah, huge difference, I'd imagine. Yeah. All right, another one from left field. Uh, are you thinking of ever making a move to UFC or are you sticking with boxing? No, for, I never for, do UFC. Yeah, I think so, no. Nah, never, nah. no, no. I, I love boxing too much and I yeah. just, I'm old, you know what I mean? I'm no, you're yeah, not. I don't have that time to learn how to do all that. You I know, suppose it nah. is pretty much a lot more brutal, isn't it? It is, like, it's, yeah. it's different. And you know what, I did keep boxing in Muay Thai when I was younger um, and I just don't fancy getting kneed and kicked no. and elbowed to the face. Like, yeah. Or like, you know, or having like someone like trying to snap my elbow on my legs. Like I'm just, yeah. uh, my hat's off to them. Like, you know, and it's also for me, I'm such a perfectionist that not, but I don't know how the training works, but I'm assuming you know, you can't do all the things every single day. So it'd be like probably one day of stand up, one day of like grappling. Like, it's like for me, it's like, how do you master it all? You can't really master it all, true, even though I would want to master it all, you know. Um, so many different elements, ah, it's too much, yeah. yeah. No, no, let me just like box people, <laughs> okay. I think there's yeah, more money in boxing for women as well. And uh, I don't know, maybe now there might be but. okay. Well, another potential career path, WWE. Bit of wrestling. Oh, I would love to do WWE, but I am so like, like injury prone, and like they're so athletic mm. that I just could see myself breaking something. Like if I try and do a flip, I'll probably break my neck or you like reckon? snap something. Yeah, but I could probably just walk out and I'd be like, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. I, just... I could do a feature. Yeah, I could do a feature, but all that stuff, the throwing around and that. Mm -mm, I, yeah, um, I think the aerobatics. Yeah, yeah, yeah flipping no, off the top no, rope no and stuff. Way. I'm actually not athletic at all. I'm just very good at what I practice because I'm very. Uh, uh, 
went like for boxing like you know i just practice it a lot so i'm you know i'm good at it yeah. but um i'm not an actually athletic at all i yeah, can't okay. even dance or anything <laughs> no way <laughs> no. oh i'm quite surprised yeah no 